Let us now begin the reading section of this Zaption. So please follow along and answer any questions that come up during the Zaption. And when you are done, feel free to read this on your own using your own iBook. Let us begin. Chapter one, introductions. This chapter is an introduction to ancient Greece, its people, its religion, and its geography. Greece is a country in the southeastern part of Europe. The main part of Greece sticks out into the Mediterranean Sea. Greece also includes many islands, including the island of Crete. Greek people live on many of the smaller islands in the Aegean Sea. And here is a map of Greece. In ancient times, the Greeks lived in some areas that are no longer part of Greece. For example, there were Greek settlements in Italy. The Greeks also lived along the coast of Asia Minor. Today, Asia Minor is part of the country of Turkey. But 2,500 years ago, the coast of Asia Minor had lots of Greek settlements. Today, Greece is all one country. Everyone who lives in Greece today has to do what the main government says. But ancient Greece was different. There were many separate areas that were all in charge of themselves. These areas were called city-states. Ancient Greece, an ancient Greek city-state, was smaller than most cities today. It was really more like a village. But the city-state also included the land that surrounded the village. About 2,500 years ago, there were dozens and dozens of Greek city-states. The two most famous city-states were named Athens and Sparta. Athenians and Spartans lived totally different lives. They had very different ideas about what was important, and sometimes they fought against each other. But certain things were the same, too. Both Athenians and Spartans spoke Greek. The Greek alphabet uses letters that are different from the English alphabet. Next week, the people of Athens and Sparta also worshipped the same Greek gods. Like the ancient Egyptians, the Greeks believed in many gods. In the next lesson, you will meet the most important Greek gods.